I is for ironwork. There's probably no other American city that has the concentration of historic forged architectural ironwork that Charleston, South Carolina does. In modern times, probably the best known Smith working in Charleston was Mr. Philip Simmons. He began his career as a general blacksmith. I, I became an artist in 1949. Amongst the motifs that Mr. Simmons brought to ironwork in Charleston were those that were based on the native plants and animals in South Carolina's low country. The folks in Charleston still seem to desire the handwork of the forge. Cast iron tends to be fairly heavy in section and it has one interesting defect in that it's very brittle. So it doesn't withstand impact very well. And believe me, in the history of Charleston, there's been lots of impact. There have been hurricanes and tornadoes and federal bombardment during the war between the states. Forged iron, on the other hand, uh, is a much softer material. So the smith takes a bar of iron, heats it in a furnace or forge until it softens, and then reshapes it using a hammer on the anvil. The American College of the Building Arts is also based in Charleston, and Mr. Simmons has been a constant supporter of our efforts to train educated artisans in traditional building trades. Just like Mr. Simmons, the students here look to the past both for information and inspiration. 